told you the CDC recently added COVID-19 shots to its routine vaccination schedule for both adults and children. Well, now we're taking a closer look at what this move means for your family. ABC Action News reporter Larissa Scott spoke with several experts finding out why federal health officials made this change. There's been a change to the CDC's schedule of routinely recommended vaccines. COVID-19 shots are now part of it. So we were all anticipating that that was going to happen based on the past couple of months of um, recommendations. The immunization schedules include current vaccine recommendations for children and adults. One of the things that the CDC does is every year they update the list of all of the vaccines that are recommended by the CDC. And this year, primary doses of the COVID-19 vaccine and boosters for people who are eligible were incorporated to both schedules for adults and kids. Basically, what that is saying is that now we have you know, enough long-term data um, and safety data that says that this is a vaccine that is safe and that is effective and that helps prevent the community spread of a disease when we're having a spike. Experts say this now means the COVID-19 vaccine will be presented as any other routine vaccination. The latest data from the CDC show only 16.4% of eligible people in the U.S. received the updated booster dose. And many health officials hope adding the shot to routine schedules will help normalize the vaccine so that everyone ages six months and older stays up to date. It's something that pediatricians in our community have been recommending for many months anyway, um, but this is just another level of it being official. However, just because these shots are now on the vaccine schedule does not mean they're mandatory for workplaces or schools. Just by being on the list alone doesn't change anything else or anything at all regarding school requirements. School entry vaccination requirements are not determined by the CDC, but instead decided by state and local jurisdictions. To read the full schedule of routine vaccines, head to abcactionnews.com. Reporting in Tampa, Larissa Scott, ABC Action News.